The school library has an upstairs. Ours only was one floor. Yep, it's pretty nice, unless couples are making out in there. So, Cassie, I have a question. Okay, shoot. What type of guy do you like? Uh, well, it doesn't matter. Uh, okay. So, you guys got invited to the dinner party, right? Yes. Yep. Fantastic. Mom said we could just hang out in my room and watch a movie till dinner's ready. Best time to go and apologize, Sarah. I still don't see why I have to, but fine. I will. That's the spirit. Shut up, Brianna. <laughs> um, hey, Rosalind, I want to say that I'm sorry for spying on you, and bugging you, and for being a snoop. Hmm, you're forgiven. And Sarah wants to invite you to her parents' house for a party. What? Hmm. Huh? Hot sauce! Oh, sorry. I'm a little random at times. Okay, then. Uh, yeah. I want to invite you to the party on Friday. Is this a prank? Of course not. Think about it. Why would we pull a prank on you? I guess you're right. I'll come. Great! See you on Friday at 7 o'clock. Bye. Cassie! Why the hell did you do that? Relax, Sarah. You want to know more about her, right? Yeah. So? So what better way to learn stuff about people than hanging out with them? Oh, right. Gotcha. Nathan, I need you to cover for me on Friday. And why? Because you know how Father is, Nathan. Fine, I'll say you went to the library. Wait, doesn't Father leave for Romania on Thursday? Not sure, Roz, but Mother will still be around. Oh, please, Nathan. She's your mother. She's a stepmother to me, since I was not born of her. And how much I envy you for not having been. Then you'd have to share the same bit as me. Cut the shit, Nathan. Now, are you gonna cover for me or not? I already said yes, Roz. Thank you. With you first.